Welcome to NHS News. You seem so excited, Connor. Well, it's Thursday, which means only one more day till Friday. Whatever. Let's get into it. Attention all seniors in IAL. Your next deadline is approaching. Please complete the module that is due on Friday, September 5th. Make sure to complete the discussion board post, journal, and IAL log. If you have any questions, please see Ms. May or Mrs. G with any questions. Attention all sophomores and juniors, you are invited to join a free PSAT prep course that will allow you to prepare for the October PSAT. The PSAT can make you eligible for thousands of dollars in scholarship money. That's some fat stacks, yo. The first class will meet September 17th during AL. Sign up on Canvas before September 15th. Need homework help? Peer tutoring is available every AL in room 2253. All you have to do is ask any teacher to sign you up in the new tutoring database and come on up and join us at 135. See Mrs. Edwards or Ms. Wiseman in guidance with questions. Are you looking for a way to get involved in the school? Join the Best Friends Forever Ever Club and help in its goal to build meaningful friendships between students of all abilities. The call-out meeting will be held September 5th in the LGI room at 145. If you have any questions, please canvas message Rebecca Hammond or Abigail Essig. Are you a leader? If so, then the Leadership Club is for you. Come out to the call-out meeting on Tuesday, September 9th, 1.35 to 2 p.m. in room 1061 at the Freshman Center. Grades 9 through 12 are welcome to attend this meeting, so come out and learn how to be an effective leader for others. Attention all bookworms, the library is open and waiting for you. There is still some construction left to be done, but the computers, printers, seating, and books are now open for your use. Yo, listen up! Tickets for the Joss Kaufman AL concert on September 11th are going on sale to the general public sooner than you think. So run down to the, either the main office, room 3009 or room 3111, and buy your ticket before they run out. Hey all you seniors, if you're interested in IU's Well Scholars program, the app has just been released. This is IU's top academic award. It is based of merit and provides tuition, academic fees, and living fees reduced for your four years at IU Bloomington. If you would like to be considered as a Wells nominee, the app is found on Naviance under the Colleges tab. Or you may download and print it from your Canvas account. See your counselor with any questions. Well, Lauren, I think we did an amazing job. I think we did too. I guess we were born to be in front of the cameras. I guess you can say that. Now let's go to birthdays, lunches, and sports. See ya, NHS. Jake, I like your headband. Well, thanks, Ally, but what can I say? I'm a trendsetter. Um, let's just get into sports. Your Lady Miller's Volleyball C team beat the North Central Panthers Tuesday at home, 25-18 to and 25-1. to Great job, ladies. The, bo the boys' soccer team took a hard loss to Fishers on Tuesday night. With Sam Reeser and Shane Coppold being your scorers for the Millers, the final score ended up being 3-2. to Better luck next time, boys, and keep, your keep up the hard work. The girls cross country team placed third behind number one ranked Carmel and number three ranked HSC in the Hamilton County meet. All county performers were seniors Jaden Fleming, seniors Megan Line, freshman Abby Little, and senior Abby Crouch. Finishing out in the top seven for the Millers were Susanna Sharples Gordon, Peyton Ali, and Emily Clauser. Good luck with the rest of your season, ladies. Keep up the great work.
The boys cross country team ran an amazing Tuesday night at Hamilton County cross country meet. The team placed fourth behind top 10 ranked teams, Carmel, HSC, and Fishers. All con cross country performances went to sophomore Eric Hoffman, sophomore Clay Oberfell, and senior Jordan Warren. Hey junior girls, Powder Puff kicks off during AL at 1.35 on Friday. Um, yes, this Friday in Miss Kitka's room 2252. Passes will be issued to go back to AL, and you should probably bring your iPad to the meeting. If you need anything, contact Miss Kitka, Miss Huffman, or Miss Brownwell. Brownell. See you Friday. Congrats to go girls golfer Peyton Gigani for a solid second place finish in the Hoosier Crossroads Conference tourney and making all conference team. Keep up the great work. Well, that's all what? for sports. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Never mind, my bad.